yeah. and I'm demoralized. <laughs> I can touch this. This soil belongs to me. So it's given 10 million. Would you buy and build a mansion in Ruiru or buy an apartment in Westlands? Okay, I can go fast yes. because I have the best answer. <laughs> so, I would definitely buy an apartment in Westlands. For me, I will buy the plot and build my own mansionette. I have an idea of somewhere in Riru, uh -huh. which I won't tell you guys because it's, it's uh -huh. a prime location which I don't want the prices to shoot, but... <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, uh -huh. of course, for me, is, uh, I value privacy. Uh -huh. I want to have my space. Uh -huh. And uh, number two is I have a very clear... Uh -huh. um, vision in my head of how I want my house to look like. Mm -hmm. So those are the two main points I would go for building. Okay. For me, yeah. yeah. Because I also want to live today and currently I work in Westlands. Yeah. Right? So I want to how how amazing would it be if I'm living and working in the same place. I don't have to commute. So the convenience of not having to spend time in traffic is great and I have all the amenities, my entertainment is around me and um, I can walk to work. I can also network with all the people that are in my line of work. They are also within really even a walking distance. So that is very good convenience. Also, I think I don't want to deal with the hassles of building, which is a big issue and we see a lot of people talking about how fundies have been messing them around. So I think that would make a good case for using that 10 million to buy an apartment in Westland and live a good life. For you, uh -huh. a small risk like an earthquake, yeah. pull, putting down the apartment, <laughs> but you, have, you have no piece of land. I'm, I'm going to buy in no, a no, building no, that no, has no, not no, been no, approved. No, no, no. For, so to, to be it, things could structurally happen. safe. Things could happen. There is terrorism. There is so many things that could okay, happen. Okay, maybe that's a real If one. the apartment was to come down, you yeah. have nothing. You have no title deed to your name. <laughs> Me, I have a nowadays, title deed. Nowadays, there are I sectional can, titles. I can, I can even I can pull actually, down. Yeah. I can use the sectional title to get a loan from a bank. Using yeah, that, so the, I actually yeah. own the, the well, the, to come the, down. The, 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 where the house is, I own that. You, what do you own? And the, if uh -huh. the apartment was sitting on a 50 by 100 mm -hmm. and it was 10 floors, then you are mm -hmm. living on the 10th floor. Yeah. And for some reason, the apartment goes down. Yeah. What, so what that, do you have? Me, I have the title deed. I could, have even, land. I could even change the house the way it is. I could sure. put down the house and put up a, a restaurant. For sure. I could put up another house. So I have, you, you can't to, change that because of the zoning so regulations. This is, yeah. So we are talking. This is yeah. Kenya. You know it. <laughs> okay. But okay, uh, you're gonna play by the rules yeah, in the ground. Yeah, but you'll, okay. yeah, you'll find all these things uh -huh. are more flexible when I'm in control of this house. Right. If it's security, I can uh -huh. put up a perimeter wall with uh -huh. an electric fence. Uh -huh. I could even put CCTV cameras for uh -huh. me to be right. uh, to look at. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. so uh, you're really on your own. Yeah. It, no, no, I'm not on my own. Yeah, because uh, you remember I have grandkids. No. <laughs> <laughs> but again, but today you, but, to, oh, you can't be living in the future. You have to live today, Tony. Yeah, yeah, but I'm, uh, I'm in, in that sense, I'm on my own. Yeah, but I'm in control of what's happening in my purview of my yeah. little paradise. For sure. Yeah, yeah. I think uh, we you raise good points about uh, living in Ruiru. It's not exactly a bad idea for me. Yeah, in my world i call that a nice life everything is within walking distance including hospitals if i move on to the next stage of my life and i have children and a spouse my kids can easily go to good schools very near not spending so much time on the road now if i fall on hard times just like that i can get a tenant in or turn it into an airbnb it is not even surprising to rent out the extra that bedroom, which I don't need until like 20 years when I have grandkids, right? Now, thinking long term, I'm still making money. All this time that I'm saving, I'm making more money. I'm buying some land somewhere to live the dream retirement home. And uh, that's why I would use that 10 million to buy an apartment in, uh, in, in Westlands. I also agree you are, I, uh, with some of your points, uh -huh. especially with uh, the kids waking up at 4 a.m. <laughs> but eventually, after uh -huh. considering all these things, uh -huh. I will still go with the mansionette in Riru uh -huh. because, number one, I'm an African. I want to own a physical piece of land and touch mm -hmm. the soil when I'm mm -hmm. waking up. Being when true I'm demoralized, to self. Yeah. When I'm demoralized, <laughs> I can touch this, this soil belongs to me. 
it's not someone else. Okay, I will so, be driving to yeah, Naniki yeah. and touching my soil. <laughs> you have to you have to walk to 50 kilometers. <laughs> Me, I just ha need to step out of the house and uh -huh. touch this soil and say, this is uh -huh. the work of my... Uh -huh. I connect with the ground. Uh -huh. If I'm having a drink and I can give libations <laughs> to my ancestors, oh, wow. I do not need to pass it through concrete. <laughs> For sure. So, so the, the, uh -huh. the second point is, mm -hmm. I have control of the house, uh -huh. how it looks, yeah. the size of it, mm -hmm. and actually, mm -hmm. even this plot, if I buy a quarter, I can build on an eighth, it's more than enough for me to put mm -hmm. up a nice structure mm -hmm. with maybe four or five bedrooms, yeah. I can pull them up yeah. and feel the, 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 mm -hmm. the feel of an apartment when I'm in the third floor mm -hmm. or, <laughs> an, or, or an your own house. Yeah, yeah. But eventually I have this big big space for myself and for my children. Can which even in host the long events. term, yeah. My kids will wake up early, uh -huh. but in the long term, uh -huh. schools will start coming up. Yeah. Uh, hospitals will start coming up because mm -hmm. the amenities follow yeah. where the people are. Right. So as more people are moving towards Ruiru, uh -huh. we'll get all these amenities. Uh -huh. And for yourself, yeah. your apartment will grow at uh -huh. a slower rate, in my opinion, right. because you have all the amenities, but if you nothing. look at our apartments, uh -huh. we are moving from uh -huh. uh, nothing at all yeah. to life. So uh, the, the precision rate, uh -huh. I could even sell this one eighth uh -huh. for a lot more money than I bought and right. built my house. So I could get back the 10 million. But, but you, In yeah. three years, I could be having... Yeah, but, but you're, you're, you're stretching the, the 10 million to buy a quarter acre and still build a home. Yeah. Have, That's, I, you're probably build, going to I, get a I, 50 build, by 100 and a home for 10 million, not, no, not no, a no. quarter. If, if I build, if I was to build, if mm -hmm. I was to look for an, an I can get an, a, a quarter piece of land uh -huh. with 2.1, 2.2, uh -huh. I've seen uh -huh. people uh -huh. selling it. Okay. In, uh, of course, the location will be a bit Based, further. Yeah. But now I have, and which also brings yeah. a new set of challenges. I, I, yeah. I could live with that, but uh -huh. now if I was to buy uh -huh. the, the, the two one aids, yeah. I can build on one, right. and then wait for Keep. the appreciation to come by, and then I can sell the other one. I could put, put up, up another rentals. building, I could yeah. put up rentals. Mm -hmm. uh, I can rear mm -hmm. my cats and my dogs without yeah. having to make noises for my immediate <laughs> neighbors in the balcony. Uh -huh. They can walk around, I can uh -huh. play with my kids in the gardens. Uh -huh. I have control of how these gardens are maintained. Mm -hmm. And I feel mm -hmm. eventually mm -hmm. my quality of life will be better in the long term okay. than living in a, an apartment in the short term. All yeah. right. Yeah, yeah. I think you paint a, you, you paint a good picture, a rosy yeah. picture. I think it all boils down to what is our definition of what a good life is, um, of the idea that I should live today with the, all the convenience I can get and be smart about my future. And... Uh, also one thing, when the possibility of route today, especially when my income and my, ass and my net worth is not so much, sometimes buying land in Kenya can feel like a gamble. But I think uh, both propositions are interesting to different kinds of people. Yes, and of course it's good to remember what is convenient today. Yeah. <laughs> so if you lived in the 80s, uh -huh. Buruburu was a very organized place, uh -huh. Karioko was a very organized place, uh -huh. it was the Westlands of uh -huh, that time. Of, yeah. Karen was a jungle, uh -huh. so someone may have uh -huh. been of the same opinion, bought an apartment in Karioko because it was <laughs> the height of convenience. Today it's a ghetto because uh -huh. Uh -huh. the people who are taking care of the services, which was the government and the county government, yeah. had a breakdown. Yeah. So someone who bought for the same price, bought a quarter piece of land in Karen, yeah. is having a higher quality of life. Awesome. And of course these things Mm -hmm. We can't never tell the future. And there's also a guy who uh, bought uh, in Karioko and also in Westlands. Later. Uh, yeah, maybe. Uh, maybe. In <laughs> Karen, later. <laughs> there could be, there could be. So and it, enjoyed uh, the best of both. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you buy for, con the, the only thing I'm saying is uh -huh. convenience is not guaranteed. Uh -huh. The convenience we enjoy here in Westlands uh -huh. is because there are amenities and some people work towards mm -hmm. making them happen. Mm -hmm. If the amenities don't exist, mm -hmm. you will be living in a small mm -hmm. apartment mm -hmm. in a very disorganized place. For sure. But if you have your own piece of land, mm -hmm. you have control of the... Nobody can come in and decide how your house is going to be run. You can have a chaotic neighborhood, mm -hmm. but inside, yeah. that's your purview. 
For sure. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, it's your little yeah. heaven. Yeah, 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 yeah. Unless, of course, you deal with the fraudsters who are known to even steal from people who have their own houses. It, uh, even apartments are not absolute from, it's not a not guarantee. Yeah. But, of course, with land, now you have to be more careful because uh, it's mm -hmm. more prevalent, but it's, uh, it's worth the risk.